Okay, this is a direct video response to some people who were having issues with uh, the GIMP tutorial which I did a wee while ago about photo editing where you're blending two images together. Uh, a lot of people, or certainly I'm having repeat comments saying I'm having problems right after copying and pasting the images, uh, the layers, uh, blah blah blah, and they're using 2.8.6. So this is an updated uh, video just to show you uh, how I do it and uh, and how you should be able to do it. So open up your GIMP and open up one file. Annoyingly, just now GIMP uh, suddenly puts its uh, things in the background, yet yeah, so they kind of disappear over there. Okay, then for the second one, I'm just going to bring in the second file and just going to go open as a layer. Let's see how that works. So as you can see, over on the left, we've got the two images side by side. So I'll just make it a bigger file and then we've got the ability to move things around left and right. Cool, so everything's working here. And then on the layer section, what we want to do is on the top layer, right click and go down to add layer mask. Again, that's gone into the background and we'll just make that white full opacity and we'll go add. So although it looks like nothing's happened, that's absolutely fine. But what we want to do is on the actual layer mask, this little bit here, we then want to add a gradient filter onto it. So when clicking on the gradient or, or on the actual layer mask, that's where you just kind of drag it along. If you drag it the wrong way, then it'll make all the image totally black uh, or totally see-through. And if you drag it the other way, then that's kind of what you're wanting. So actually, I'm just going to sort this out. So I'm going to put it so one file is on top of the other. And make sure that your colors are black and white. So whenever you drag it across, uh, the black and white uh, creates your actual kind of layer blending going on. But there, as you can see, you just drag it along and no problems there left and right. So as you can see, the back image and the front image. I'll, I'll do a clearer example just now. Okay, so here's a photo which is completely not related to the last one. I'll just move it to the side. And again, same thing. So on it, go add layer mask. Make sure it is full opacity. Or if you do it the other way, it's not a problem. And then get the gradient brush. And not that way, but this way. And then go to image and then fit canvas to layers so now we've got a big old canvas that looks like that so for example if you're doing a, a, an image where it's like these guys live in a house like this and then once you've done that use the crop tool which goes over it all then on the layers I'm just going to go and click flatten layer and then now the, the only thing which I've noticed that's different is when I do file instead of going save as is now export so if you do export and then you get to choose all your quality settings and it should be absolutely fine so over at the side yep two files merged check that you're following all those uh, instructions and tell me how you go if, it is, if it's not working for you do a video and show me uh, and I'll might be able to tell you exactly what what bit you're missing okay hope that helps bye bye